Hello and welcome back to Outer Worlds. Seems like we are heading toward the... The Antibiotics Lab 13. I uh, hope you guys are ready. Oh crap, maybe we should do a little bit of looting. And maybe we've got three locations that we want to check out. Actually, we have a lot more than that. Open fire! Don't mess with us. Open fire on the Light other pharaoh as well. Their mistake. Oh, what? Oh my god. Here we go! I got this! I'll fix you right up! They're in different order. I wanted to use the hammer. <laughs> Never mind that. Okay. Well, this place is basically a no-brainer. The losses. That's the last of them. Okay. Uh, this game. Kind of rewards, uh, of course, this this kind of game is more focused on just providing you a great experience uh, on, uh, like, on, um, it's not really an open world game. You, you, can, you definitely have a way to explore the area if you want to, like we kill these uh, beasts around here, but it, it does, the game doesn't, like, seriously encourage you. And I'm not truly against that. I, I prefer good experiences. Like, they, they can make, like... The, the problem with most open world experiences is that it just basically boils down to... Uh, it's just a lot of boring stuff. And it kind of makes sense. Like, look at this just uh, alien planet. You're not going to find interesting stuff if you just wander off. Business. I hope he's okay. If you ever went like camping or whatever, you're like maybe you yes, really yes. enjoy the forest, right. but you're just not gonna find loot, or you just go to the desert. Oh crap! That's actually not a good choice of weapon array. Oh crap! Basically what I'm saying that I, I tend to prefer like uh, uh, the game focusing on, on really awesome experiences instead of just like, yeah, you can just go into open world and, you know, you're probably gonna get a little bored. It can be good, but I do like, uh, maybe I, I do prefer this. So we're just killing a lot of beasts, and there's not much else going on here. So we can enter into the antibiotics lab. Maybe I want to look around this place before we head in. Okay, two ways to get in. This is probably the back entrance. But it doesn't really matter. First back, second back, Fraser Bros. Woo! Standard troop helmet. My hacking is legendary. All personnel, please report to assigned workstations. Report suspicious activity to the nearest site safety engineer. Um, Raptodon, fluid in a gestation test. Objective. Objective determine the maximum amount of Raptodon digestive acid that can be safely ingested by humans before adverse effects present themselves. 
proposed procedure slowly introduce increasing amounts of rhapsodone digestive acid into the evening meals of randomly selected workers and observe their overall health. One milliliter. Minor stomach pain and nausea. Safe. Yeah, but that's still not ideal, is it? Minor stomach pain, extreme nausea, safe. You you call that safe? Three. Major stomach pain, debilitating nausea, some vomiting, potentially unsafe in the workplace. That's potentially unsafe. Temporary blindness, frequent vomiting, patient unable to describe pain, unsafe. Well. Wow. Unable to record symptoms as patient died within the hour. Okay. How rude of him to do that. Die molar. Is there a way to just uh, turn off the action camera? I wouldn't mind it. I'm not sure if it's possible. It would be gameplay. Uh, I don't think it's possible. Come over here. For fights is kinda dangerous. Ellie's dead. Super dangerous. Oh my god. I didn't realize it's gonna be so bad. Okay, I just need to forget about this sh stupid shotgun. Actually, I pr sh probably should uh, transform all my weapons into uh, plasma and energy weapons because I have a. Some kind of a bonus for using these, and I have plenty of ammo. I just, I just need all the DPS. This tech shotgun is just not good enough. Not good enough for uh, most fights. Okay, we gotta be careful. I'm, I'm not sure. I, I do like them on on aggressive. It's very convenient. But at the same time, it's... I, I don't want to just click on every enemy. Wow. I thought we were past this, guys. You dying. But goddammit. Super Nova is not easy. I guess that was a stealth critical. First one. Don't mess with us. Okay, I can get on board with this weapon. And I probably have enough bullets to keep using it. Let's be honest here. I, I feel a little bad for just not using bullets. But maybe I will be able to uh, utilize the small ammo. Coming back. Later. Currently, I don't have a good way to do it. Mm, it's kind of crappy. Just stay with me and don't stray too far. Robots are quite tough. Are you guys? Sure. Where are you? 
You should not run off ever. Okay, I don't know where you guys were, but you gotta stay with me. Be right there. So I gotta park them in combat, or, or else they're gonna run off. Oh fuck, they're still running off. On my way. Sure. Yeah, we got him. Oh, come on, robot. Oh my god, two. Retreat. The last of them. Yeah, but that was tougher than I hoped. Leaded armor. Okay, so you use two-handed melee. I might just uh, try that in some of the playthrough, but I do enjoy shooting usually. Uh, it's it's a more involved activity than just uh, swinging your melee weapon. So I prefer the aiming aspect of uh, this game. Sure. And it feels like it gives me more more way. of a strategic. Uh, Depth to the fights. Holy crap. It's not good. What kind of weight value are we okay with? So this is 12. And that would be a good to see as a, like a number. Weight value of of like a specific number because I just have to uh, figure it in my head which is fine I guess but uh, obviously the, the whole point of it is just that the game kind of does it for you maybe tech skills of five uh, it's a weight value of uh, kind of like seven and a half and it's also 24 armor is that that is maybe a little better no, but we're using the long guns one. That that's that's clearly uh, preferable here. Ellie's using a better one. Although, no, no, it's it's not losing any condition. Okay, these seem to be fine. Uh, but let's just try it. So twenty-four, twenty-six. Yeah, 29, 32, obviously, that is better. <clears throat> Long Guns Helmet, uh, that is something that I can consider using for fights. Heavy Helmet, uh, that's obviously better. But I also, no, 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 fine, we're good now. On companions, you you basically always want to use heavy armor because their carry weight is not affected. They have their own carry weight. And I would probably go for the, the perk that gives me carry weight bonus. For every companion. Ooh, that's a tough pick. Can I get any better at that. I'm a slightly sleepy. If I look at the skills, lockpicking, it's basically as good as it gets. Uh, I can make my lockpicking better by increasing my mind or, or, or body a little bit, but I don't think it would matter because I'm at 55. Let's pick it. Let's use two picks for this. Nice going. Okay. Used to pick locks. This is cheap and also uh, comes in handy quite often. Mm. 
So this is the front entrance. Security blade that I don't care about. I don't really know the, the true power of these melee weapons. But it does seem like using ranged weapons for companions is the way to go. So a 26 helmet and a plasma rifle. I can use that 26 helmet myself. <clears throat> Although it drops my lock picking, but it's not super important. But I think the other characters are fine. I think uh, that only matters if they shoot you in the head. I'm not even sure if that's... Well, maybe that's possible for in melee combat. Lift, lockdown, hallway door. Hallway door unlocked. As is protocol, an authorized entry will be marked in site supervisor Crane A's records. So this probably unlocked the door that I actually picked earlier. Um, we need a new code for the armory lock over in storage facility. Make it complicated so Orson can sneak in there again. And do not write it down this time. Use your brains. How about in this order? The month of your birthday. How many security rotations we have per hour. Uh, the number of accidents we had this month involving that damn culture processor. The maximum volume in milliliters of reptilian stomach acid a human being can digest before we consider it lethal. Oh, so I need to gather this information. Oh my god. I think the last one is four. Our porter. Sounds fine, thanks. I gained the storage facility passcode. Is it one, two, three, four? <laughs> For real. A pulse hammer. If I focused on melee combat, then I, I suspect that these melee weapons would be a lot more impressive. But not right now. Oh, 15 to 1 weight value ratio. Ooh, big fight with the robos. I already overlooked this area. Climb up, but don't really want to. More Adreno. I I have 49 Adrenos. So. It ain't stealing if no one sees. Attack shotgun. Kinda has decent. I just get rid of that spade. Decent stats. But the problem is the effective range. All these drugs that I never use. Actually, it would help a lot to use them uh, for fights, but the game is not set up to handle it. So, if, for example, if I could make hotkeys for all these consumables, it would be a lot better. And also, it's a bit of a hunt to actually find something useful uh, for combat. But yeah, when we see combat, especially tough combat, this is what I should do, that we just do drugs before the combat. And uh, yeah, well, look at this, Armor's, armor rating, so we should definitely keep that, this in mind. <sighs> Can I replace Adreno? No, you cannot replace Adreno as like the quick key heal, but when I... Yeah, increases base health. 
It seems like Adreno might be like super cheap that I, I would just end up wasting it along other uh, consumables. I just have so many consumables right now that it's very justifiable just to use them every time. Look at this. Range weapon spreads lower. This doesn't matter for me. I can aim my guns just fine. And most of these uh, are just base health plus. And it's possible that these stack. So we just uh, increase our base uh, health significantly. Although it's unlikely, because now I would like, oh, I have 300% base health. How convenient. Uh, it seems like we may have checked out everything here. Quest type, location region. Yeah. I think we have a, a mission here. One, two, three, four. Uh, that's where we have to go. Rescue Jameson. And apparently he is in here. Isn't he? Seems like it. At least the map is pointing this way. Can I just get outside? 15? Okay, let's go upstairs. Yeah, we missed at least one room. Everyone, I'm sick and tired of cleaning bone out of the culture processor. This is the third time this month. The next employee to get their hand stuck in that damn machine is getting written up. Uh, we lost another finger to that infernal culture processor. I'm formally requesting new safety brackets to be installed as the current ones register with raptor on hind, but not human flesh. This is unacceptable. Wow. Yeah, break that down, and we're taking the rest. Auntie Cleo's better than nature. Jameson, we got you. Or my back Are we gonna pick this up? Just very quickly. We don't wanna leave it here for the uh, uh, beasts, right? What? Come on, you can you can relax. How the? Wait, I know you. You're responsible for the Emerald Vale fiasco. How the hell did you get in here? What? First, I shot the raptodons, then I walked up the stairs. No, not... I don't care about the beasts. I care about the front door, 
This is an egregious breach of protocol. How'd you get in? Do you want to die? Anton sent me to get you. Ugh. Can't use the centrifuge without supervision. Can't file reports without him double-checking their every word. Can't save myself from mortal peril. It's like he thinks I'm a child. His hands-on management style is coming to a point of contention, I tell you. You, well, I'm, I don't want to stop you. You should uh, d definitely take this up with Anton. Take it up with him if you like. Now go before more raps find this place. Hi, Jameson. <sighs> this is great. I need to drink something. Let's drink that. Anton, that is the model employee you deserved. <laughs> okay, so we checked out this place and... Oh my god. I gotta go with location region. Deal with the abandoned experiment. Uh, I'm not sure where we're gonna head next. Maybe, maybe it should be there. Talk to Anton, that's going back. Retrieve the schematics. Stress signal. Find Anton safe. Oh no, not talking to Anton. Let's retrieve the schematics. We're gonna go that way. Heavy ammo. I seem to have enough heavy ammo. This gun is awesome. Oh, look at that. Keep it down. Here we go. Oh, what? I didn't expect these geckos to help out. The marauders. Oh, let's scrap that. Where's the other marauder? He kind of had crappy, ha uh, crappy helmets. But I still would like to loot him. I can't see people in this foliage. Oh, there he is. Oh, that's the one I already looted. God damn it. They call that a parking job? These pirates are making the rest of us look bad. I really like this gun. There I'm going to dead. Nothing personal, I swear. Yeah, taking his Adreno. Pretty good. Okay. One thousand damage. Here we go. Oh, who did? Oh, I'm going. come back. I don't understand why the doggies are with the hooligans. Heading back.
At least we can engage from very far away. I guess we use the extra ones from the inventory. Because my max health went up. Most likely here. Perks, skills. No? Unclear. Oh. No. Shoot the. Die! Okay, what's wrong? I'm concussed, and every attribute I have is reduced. Perfect. Can I check it out? So, inventory... I am... Yeah, I'm overburdened a little bit. Makeshift low pressure suit. Uh, let's break it down. There's not much we can do here. If I level up, it's pretty guaranteed that I'm taking extra carry weight. But let's see if we can... Uh... Yeah, we need the lockpick. This helmet can just go away. Break down. Um... That's not a, not a bad armor at all, but I guess I can scrap it. Still kind of heavy. Tech skills. What about weapons? Weight value. Shock cannon, 12 to 1. Eh. Junk. Junk is usually worth it. Good value. Maybe you just get rid of the shock cannon. Okay. Make him regret. What? Yeah, this is very nice. Uh, the long range allows us to engage enemies uh, one by one. Oh, this is where I probably didn't find uh, the Marauder. It turned to dust. That makes looting a little more difficult. Dead Eye Assault Rifle? I'm still concussed? When is that going to go away? Never. As far as I know, that only goes away if we sleep. But it's a heavy penalty. Very heavy penalty. So, you get concussed, you might as well go back to the bloody ship. Uh, to whom it may concern, I've been anti Cleo man my whole life. When I got promoted to the Roseway deforestation team, I felt privileged and honored. I believe anti Cleo uh, was going to tame the wild landscape and pave it over with civilization, better than nature. That's your motto. I wanted to be a part of that initiative. I wanted to see Roseway become an object of envy among corporate outposts. I wanted to wave our quarterly reports in front of every Spaces Choice worker I've ever known and laugh in their face. I've worked from down 
to dusk, uh, dawn to dusk without a word of complaint. Now you have me working on building walls around the town. We've given up on expansion and half the town's already been relocated. Worst of all, the deforestation teams being disbanded and my equipment's left to rust in the landscape. If you're reading this, then you have found my letter of resignation. I would rather make my own way as an outcast living outside the law than work under these conditions. Okay. <laughs> Probably is dead. But I already got one of these heavy rifles. But it's, this is kind of like a pretty good rifle. And I might want to just keep repairing it, right? Maybe that was not required. Oh my fucking god. We need to re get rid of the conquest penalty. <sighs> I'm thinking we should return to the ship, but... Maybe I, I, I'm kind of fine without that. You guys coming? <gasps> oh, that's a lot of bandits. We gotta uh, take a good far away location. Heading out. And engage on on a high ground and engage a lot of bandits. I just heal. You know what? Let's do some drugs. I don't care about that. Crit damage. Okay, we can drink that. Harmful status effect duration. I want the bonus health. If I can find one of those. <sighs> Where's the bonus health? Oh yeah, that's that's one. Okay, let's attack. Go back. Can you go? Fucking hell, I hate you. I'm going. Run away, run away, run away. I hate you guys, I hate you guys. Go, go run away. I'm going. Run away, run away, run away. All right, if I can move. individually uh, control them, I'm going. or maybe they were not terribly dumb, we would be in a good spot. So I did uh, the classic bot herding operation here. And this is such a bummer that uh, their combat intelligence is a little bit taking me out of the game. So we had to go for the... I, I just place them on the top of the hill of course is there a way to individually place them i don't think sure. so you can only Be place right them there. at one point on my way <sighs> and uh ellie was standing uh in the line of fire way 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 above what's ideal but parvati was actually standing way below what was ideal so for example if you want to shoot at uh like i don't know like that tree stump of a person, you would be standing kind of like... That's actually wouldn't be an ideal location for that, but you know, like kind of like over here. Maybe even crouch down. Just just so just show the as little of your body as possible. 
but Ellie was standing like over here and she was the only one who was getting hit and Parvati was just standing way fucking back. That was super dumb. <sighs> On my way. It it worked better when I had one follower. At least the 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 system. How you control it. All, one thing they would have to do, and this is one thing that I would like to have a mod for, is that instead of one F, or maybe like one, you can have one F, just just shows that where they go together. You can just have uh, ways to tell them how where to go individually. But even that would be a little bit questionable. Uh, their AI would need to be improved slightly, so they would like to not get hit. With us. He's not sure about fighting. Here we go. Got it. it needs to be like a hold your ground mode. Fucked up. On my way. So we managed to kill a lot of them, and probably many of them turn to dust, uh, which will be extremely hard to find. Let's pick up the ring. I'll look into it. Uh, if uh, there are any mods available just for this, because this is the only annoyance I have with the game right now, is that the AI is uh, that's probably not going to be improved by modders, but. The, the tools to control your companions that might be like imagine if like the companions like took cover on the corner like peeked out and like uh, reloaded I'm like I, I, I'm not suggesting that this game needs to be like fucking counter strike or shit like that but you know at least they can pretend to be people in combat all right so we got to this place actually there's like a little bit of a Building? No, no, no. Those are just some tanks. There's nothing here. Is this, isn't this like a big door? No. It's getting shite. And because of it's supernova, like uh, if you were playing on like any other difficulty, we would be able to quick save before the fight. And if it just turns out badly, you know, no problem, I guess. But on Supernova, I would have lost a lot of progress, and I had to go for the stupid herding operation that I was running away, they were running away, I was running away, away behind them, so I can tank the shots, so Ellie doesn't get hit, and I would let the spam heal, of course. Very odd. I couldn't just order Ellie away, I had to order uh, the entire group away. We couldn't just like cover it for a uh, cover. We couldn't just like say that you know, Ellie, you go back, Parvati and me, we're just gonna hold the position, no problem. But no, the only way to uh, order Ellie away is to order Ellie and Parvati away. And I, I suppose I, I could have stayed alone, uh, but I also had to cover for Ellie because Parvati is obviously not gonna do it. Uh, Dr. Crane, pursuant to our conversations of the previous week, why the ammunition storage locker larger than my bathroom? I have dispatched Sullivan with the triplicate paperwork you requested. As a reminder, I'm currently the sole pr pr property manager for all three facilities and I remain the only person required to sleep on site rather than in Roseway. According to human resource standards, my position entitles me to refreshment facilities of not less than 4 square meters. I spent all yesterday cleaning a man's arm out of a meat grinder and I don't even have a damn shower out here. Fix it or I'm going to start breaking into your room and showering there. Then you can experience the joy of cleaning gristle out of your drain. Remember, I have entire crates of MacBooks here. You know I can do it. 
Ruben, I'm starting to run low on caffeine supplements. Any chance you can bring some by? I had an urge to rearrange my storeroom all day. Maybe you could help with that again? Why not? We could uh, hike to the terraformer. It's been a while since last time. Wind in my hair, just quiet. I wouldn't mind that. Feels like all I do anymore is mop up viscera or sit here twiddling my thumbs. I don't know, you tell me. Anton, haven't heard back from you. Uh, there was a receipt of uh, acknowledgement right on top. I expect you to sign and return it forthwith. While I have your eye, have you heard uh, from Porter? It uh, doesn't seem like anyone's uh, responding to my messages today. Uh, things are hairy out there. Lock the doors. Keep your head down. Stay safe. Uh, Mashenka, I'll come for you. Stuff. Now, don't worry. I will be stealing everything here. <clears throat> Actually, I leveled up. So we can distribute some perks. Carry weight bonus from companions. Vendor buying prices. I think we're gonna go for the carry weight bonus from companions. Even if it's just 40 kilogram, it's great. And if it's 80 kilogram, that's amazing. So let's go for that. Ah, that's 80 kilogram, which is crazy. Okay, I guess we don't have to worry too much about uh, not being able to move. So that's 130 extra uh, carry weight. But what am I going to point into? Inspiration could be good. Uh, companion skills bonus to player skills, 100%. So if I go with that, every time I'm getting bonuses, I'm getting even bigger bonuses. Engineering. It's kind of hard to see right now, but... Uh, Ellie is giving me medical and engineering and lying. I don't really use lying that much. <laughs> I may be lying about that. Um, but yeah, we can up the inspiration to 60. So the skills, skill bonus I, I get are, are higher. Hack. Lockpick at 40 seems okay. But if I if I go with that, then the lockpick bonus I get from uh, Parvati is going to be higher. So we're going to go with Inspiration. And of course, this not only increases the companion damage by 73%, which is just crazy. But also, bonus skills, that seems amazing. Silver Tongue Kit. Look at this, 20 and 26. Engineering is 53. Lockpicking is 53. Persuasion is 57. Ah, oh, looks good. But I'm concussed twice. Ah, oh, that's a heavy penalty. What about lockpicking? Plus 21. So this would be a 61 plus 5 bonus. So we can be pushing this to 66. Anti-riot gear. I'm, I'm not the best shooter, but yeah, this is pretty good. And the companions get more healing. I might go for that. We're probably not going to go uh, much higher than this. It does seem pretty tempting to go much higher, but look at this. For example, if a companion is down, part gains a 50% armor and damage. Or, uh, yeah, but like downed. Down this means down down just doesn't happen on supernova. So the perks were not necessarily designed with supernova in mind. And of course, like supernova kind of changes the the balance of uh of what you want. So for example, like threat generated, like this is just completely useless. And medical, that that's kind of useful, but not dying, that's so important. I might just go for uh, companions get extra health because not only this would give the companions extra health uh, based on the determination, 
but also uh, they would get a little bit of extra health from the inhalers, which seem to play a bit of a role. It's not super important, but I, I think it's 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 fine. We'll see. <laughs> I'm not too good in a melee fight, or no, not super defensive, but I'm I'm not basing on my strategy on getting hit in the face. Like I, I just don't see too much value in this. You you can be super defensive. Only only way you can be defensive is when you're holding a melee weapon. But wouldn't you just kill the opponents? <laughs> That's that's a lot better way to uh, defend yourself, and we might have to boost deck a little bit. Uh, actually, it's not crazy. No, we, we don't we don't have to, but we can we can boost it up to. We'll see. Corrosion damage, and rate damage. We can unlock a mi mixing slot for plus eight points. Maybe that's gonna help us in uh in tough fights. Who knows? You know what would be great? What I kind of nice didn't value so far is uh, a silent modification for my weapon. Everyone, all right? So I can just uh, snipe people all day long and set up uh, easier fights. Because why fight five guys when you can like go down to like three guys before uh, everybody engages you? Yeah. Level eight. You know the passcode, and I have sufficient carry weight. Oh, let's take that. This place is in terrible shape. It's the exit. Uh, 6 to 1 value. Also, this is a base health booster. The hide is more valuable. Kill the robot before he gets up. Didn't even get our hands dirty. Oh, I need to get rid of the shotty. It just does nothing. And I'm I have plenty of ammo for my rifle, so I guess we're just not using shotty anymore. Robot. Oh my god, this robot is not dead. Shit, kill the robot! Go in the corner. Set up some dumb crossfire. Maybe I should have like some kind of shotgun for these robots. Because they seemingly don't care about plasma. Back. Do I have a... No, we don't have a weapon modification. Uh, worship here. Uh, 
Okay. All this space, and this is all they get to sleep in? So where is the armory? Like, is this entire place the armory? Gotta be something more. What's with the jumping puzzles game? Leading somewhere. Oh, yeah. We can go downstairs. Alright. Didn't I loot this place already? This seem very familiar. Yes, I have. Armory logs, here we go. Uh, force of... Polo G Sias. Whatever. Some pistol status. Synchrotron. Floji Synchrotron. Pistol status. Functional. Untrained personnel must attend this, this safety seminar. SO23 before using. As a seminar officer is not currently available, recommend permanent secure footage. Okay. Oh, plasma carabine. Uh, yeah, we'll be taking that. Under troop armor. I kind of expected. I expect a lot more from this uh, place. It's supposed to be the armory. Acid steeper. Isn't this the thing that we need for Sam? Yes, it is. I kind of forget about that. Is. This must be where Mr. Shaw's been working. Week one. O six petrol route passed too close to the experimental subject uh, pens. Now there is wrapped spit gunking up the servos in its uh, gun arm. We don't have a replacement arm, so I guess we dismantle this one for parts. At least twelve and uh, seventeen are still working. Someone tried to disable the mandatory consumer broadcast on 17. The thing got stuck in maximum volume mode until the factory reset it. Mandatory consumer broadcast. 12 had a serious malfunction today. Porter accidentally tripped one of the sensors inside the walls, so the blasted unit thought everyone was an intruder and just started shooting. We shut it down for now, but we requested new behavior modules from HQ for the rest of the units. No response on behavior modules. For the time being, we we'll have to hope nobody blows up the wall. A wall. Yeah. That's a lot of trouble for like one warehouse of guns. Uh oh.
Die, Robot! I should definitely try shock-based weaponry against these robots. Joint actuator. What? Is this it? I have to go by location. No, we, we still want to re retrieve Orson's schematics. Oh, it's here. That's it? Just odd looking pistol picture on the wall? You would think that this is just some, some old school drawing. Technical drawing. Detailed drawings of an advanced pistol. Revision and comments are scrawled across the image in mostly legible writing, except for the name Orson Shaw scribbled in the corner. The schematics depict a Floji synchro Synchrotron pistol from a brand named Force, which is not native to Halcyon Colony. It's unclear from these plans what uh, body synchrotron does. Well, let's just take it, I guess. What else we can do here? We can return to Orson, okay. So we wanna return to Orson, uh, re talk to Anton, deal with the abandoned experiment, which is not here. It's over there. Acquire Anton's research, acquire Bond's research, return to Gladys on the ground baker. Oh, nice. They can return to Gladys. That's just an option, but we're gonna do that later. Find Anton's safe. What? And, yeah. For now... I think the best choice is possibly go back uh, to the ship and after that maybe return to town or just not care about it. Possibly return to town and uh, but we need to get rid of the concussed uh, penalty we have on us. Uh, returning to town is not super important, I feel like. Uh, we can just do that later. I suppose uh, fast traveling to the ship is uh, mainly done in a way to uh, prevent the player from dying. So if you really need to sleep, uh, maybe you're like stuck somewhere, then, then you can uh, avoid death. Crew members Ellie and Max are engaged in a heated discussion in the kitchen. Sounds good. Oh, maybe I should get it on that. Max. Maximilian. Vicar. Vicky. What? Shoot, I forgot. It'll come to me. Is that the heated discussion? Well, I'm really glad I didn't miss this one. So let's just let's just go for a nap. Yep, sounds good. Uh yep, so thanks for watching guys and see you next time. Let's go to sleep.